speaking of, of kids, uh, what do you think about the whole T.I. thing that he takes his, uh, his daughter to the gynecologist to make sure she's still a virgin? My first thought was just why? You know, I, I didn't really think too much into it, but, you know, it was discussed in my household. I heard it being talked about, and then I saw it wrote up, and I was like, I was like, that's that's real close parenting right there. But I'm sure he has his reasons. Well, his daughter's 18. Right. Which, I mean, that's just kind of a violation of an adult, honestly, I think. And, but I, I think that this is what happens when money gets in, when a lot of money gets involved. Mm -hmm. You see what I'm saying? When you try to control your kids through money and, and it's. Well, it could, you, you could just be demanding honesty at the same time, too. It's just like, well, tell me if you get a guy, become sexually active. Right now, they got a new strain of HIV out right yeah, now. Yeah, facts. You know what I mean? So, you know, I can't really, I, I'm not going to judge the man anyway. But one way or the other, in this situation, I can't look at it and say he's wrong. I can't look at it and say, I, just, I can say, it's, it's borderline, you know, micromanaging, you know, her life as a, you know, as a young lady. But at the same time, if you don't protect your children, who are? But do you need to protect them that closely? So, you know, it, it just becomes a judgment call at that point. Yeah, I'm sure T.I. was having sex. I'm sure he have his reasons. I'm sure T.I. was having sex way before 18. I'm sure he have his reasons why he's doing it. Why it became public knowledge, I have no well, he, clue. He mentioned it in a podcast. Yeah. He, he talked about it publicly. So he must think it's some cool shit. Yeah. I don't know about that. I mean, every, I'm with you. Everyone pretty much was not cool with it. No, that. I said, I'm with you. I don't, yeah, I, <laughs> I didn't read the comments or follow up with it. I just heard about it and I was like, hmm, why? You know, but uh, okay, you must have some reason for it, bro. And that's your daughter. So. You know, hey, yeah. she like it. I love it, you know. Well, she does like it because people were like in her comments talking about how messed up th that was. And she was like liking those comments, you know. No, I know. I know she don't like it. But what can she do about it? That's what I, I was well, just, she's 18. She that was just being yeah. facetious. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. She like it. I love it. You know what I mean? Yeah, so no, I feel you. It's on her to do something about it, not me. I can I can start a petition, stop T.I. from checking his daughter's hymen and shit, and, you know, and that's not going to do a motherfucking thing. Start a GoFundMe. Back up to shit. We're going to make up the money T.I. is going to give you with his GoFundMe. Never. So you don't give, have to get your hymen checked. Never. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is so messed up. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Uh, <clears throat> I guess the weird part is that the father is doing it as opposed to the mother. You know, because he's still it. married. Like, why, why isn't the mother handling this That's part of the it. job? That's it. I think if she was doing it, it wouldn't even be an issue. Probably not. Yeah. Not as much of an because issue. Because men, I guess, and especially black men, aren't noted to be that involved in their teenage daughter's lives to that degree. That's kind right. of like, you know, yeah. That's, I feel you. Yeah, 